Brett? Okay, so the technique that we're working on, guys, is our um, pull down the double leg takedown. When we're doing this technique, guys, it's really important that one, I make control, make hold on to the back of the head, into the arm, and when I pull down, I pull down with my whole body. His natural reaction is to spring back up, and then we're gonna go through it. So it should look something like this. I get to position, I pull, he raises up, and then I shoot in to start going in for my takedown and start getting into position, all right? So when I do this, Every single time that I, uh, that, I, that I tie up, if I tie up head and arm, this is exactly where I'm gonna go. There is no real feel out process for me to do something else or to, to get anywhere else. It's like once I make control, I'm gonna pull them as hard as I can down. So I get to here, back of the head, on the arm, he grabs me the same way and from here, I'm gonna sit as hard as I can and then let him go, completely let him go. He pops up and I drive my knee down and start taking him down until we get into this position, all right? Um, can you switch to this? So the only thing that I see people do and they sometimes mess up, I grab on and I grab on and I pull and I have students that will do this, pull them down and then the other person is trying to fight their way back up but they're holding on to them. You have to let them go and let them spring back up. This whole position is just because I pulled them really hard, they're gonna resist and from here I start driving through and everything's the same as the last technique. The technique happens not behind the knees but behind the calves and I press my shoulder right into his belt or right into his, uh, into his belly button and I press him all the way through until he starts falling, all right? So right now we're not working on anything after this. What I want you to practice is the takedown, I'm sorry, the pull down, and then when he uh, jumps back up, I get into the shoot and I get into my position. Afterwards, we'll start talking about where we need to be after we end up with the takedown, all right? That's it.